seeking. Hello. So I wanted to make a jacket for my dog, and I didn't want to spend a lot of money on it. So I have a just a plan here that I traced out. I drooped over my dog, and it looked pretty good. I may alter it by adding a strap underneath her belly. Um, so I'm going to use some medical shears on this coat that is nice and water resistant, wind resistant on the outside, but nice and warm on the inside. I just picked this up for like five bucks, so I'm going to cut it up and see how it all works out. So I just cut this out. I definitely wanted more room for anything else that would happen. I'm not sure if I want to cut a hole and have her leg go through the holes or if I want to just um, cut that round and then velcro the front but that's that scissors work pretty good I think mm, they were tricky getting through some of the seams where it was thicker but other than that they were pretty fast in some of the sections here so now I have my cutout piece I think I'm pretty much done with that I gotta trim this a little bit and then I'm gonna sew up everything so this is gonna go underneath her rib cage her chest and this is just gonna go around her neck and then this is going to go here, and it's going to go across her front chest there. Her head's going to come right through here. <clears throat> so that's that. I'm probably going to trim up this here. But for the most part, that's that. I just need to get some Velcro as well and trim it up, make it all nice, nice. Good girl. This is the finished product. It has a Velcro strap in the front and underneath. Good girl. This is the pattern that I went with. Those are the Velcro straps. Like that. I kind of left this here. I'm not sure if I would hang it up like that or use it for anything. But the edge we put on it was we went twice around. And then we, uh, did the edge again? I did that twice around. So, yeah, that's pretty much that. Ta da! Thanks for watching, and don't forget to click the link below in order to find out more.